traditional habits are based on trigger, routine, reward. What I learned with digital habits is that they're very different. Think of the difference between a racetrack, which is like a traditional habit. You have one way onto the racetrack, it's very fast, you go around the racetrack, and you know, that's like you see your shoe, you tie your shoe, right? Whereas a digital habit is like a beltway around the city. So if you think about a beltway around the city, it's much bigger and there are many more on-ramps onto that. And you need to think more strategically about how you're going to get people onto those on-ramps. This is a faster way to get from point A to point B. So let me give you an example. Amazon is a great example in this area. Think about how we engage with Amazon. We will go on to read a book, we'll watch a movie, we'll buy a gift for a friend. These are all different on-ramps and triggers that get us onto the Amazon ecosystem. And that is what my book is about, is how the best companies in the world are really building these ecosystems that pull people in, even after months of non-use. I mean, you, the people don't use Amazon for a while, but then they go back. Whereas with a traditional habit, if you stop doing your sit-ups for a while or brushing your teeth for a while or some other habit, you're not going to do that anymore.